Are you facing foreclosure and feel like the banks have all the advantages? Many people don't know that there are a number of regulations that people fail to take advantage of that can and do help them fight a foreclosure. Today, I'm going to tell you a little bit about these regulations and how you can use them to fight a foreclosure. These tips will help you hold banks accountable for their own sloppy business practices. Hi, I'm Jim Kevney of the Kevney Legal Group. We are a New Jersey and Pennsylvania based law firm that focuses on helping clients avoid foreclosure. As a result, we are very familiar with the regulations that govern lenders, but are often ignored by those same lenders. Fortunately, this practice of ignoring regulations can come back to bite the banks, but only if you know how to use them. One such regulation is the Truth in Lending Act, or TILA. Congress enacted TILA to standardize credit disclosures to consumers. Lenders often violate TILA by failing to make disclosures regarding the amount of the loan, finance charges, annual percentage rates, the amount financed, or the borrower's right to rescind. Violations of TILA could give a borrower a right to rescind the loan, statutory damages or set-offs, or other forms of relief. Another commonly violated regulation is the Real Estate Settlement Procedures Act, or RESPA. It was created to eliminate kickbacks that increase the cost of loan settlement services. It also reduces the amount a borrower had to put in escrow for property taxes and insurance payments, and it results in a more effective disclosure of settlement costs. Unfortunately, many lenders routinely violate these disclosure requirements. As a result, borrowers may be entitled to monetary damage and other remedies. A third commonly violated regulation is the Fair Debt Collection Practices Act. Many creditors, not just banks, violate these laws while trying to collect debts by engaging in prohibited conduct. These include discussing your obligation with third parties, harassing phone calls, failing to make legally required disclosures about debtors' rights, and others. Violations of these laws can result in both financial penalties and even a bar to collection of the underlying debt in extreme circumstances. Finally, the statute of limitations can also be an effective tool in fighting a foreclosure. Not only can it apply to a foreclosure filed too long after the default first occurred, it can also be used in cases that have languished in the courts for too long. In some instances, even if a case can be dismissed on grounds such as improper assignment of the note and mortgage, the statute of limitations may prevent the foreclosure from being refiled. Of course, these are just a few of the possible ways to use regulatory violations against lenders. The exact circumstances of your case will determine which course of action is right for you. At Kevney Legal Group, we help clients fight banks that are trying to take their homes away. We would be happy to discuss the circumstances of your situation with you in a free, no obligation consultation to help you determine your appropriate course of action. You can reach us by email at jim at kevneylegalgroup.com or by phone at 1-800-219-0939. I'm Jim Kevney. Have a wonderful day.